Hey, how's it going everyone? I'm Farrell SC, and welcome back to our single player series in Ark Survival Evolved. So in the last episode, we, uh, so we're still over here on Scorched Earth. Um, in the last episode, we ended up taming a level, uh, what was it, 140, 145, uh, female Rex. And I was pretty content on heading back over to the island because we also have a 150 Rex over, uh, over there that we tamed at, uh, Carno Island. Um, I then realized that the 150 that we tamed, I'm pretty sure is a female. So we're not gonna be able to breed or anything like that. Um, so I've actually stayed on, uh, obviously we're still here on Scorched Earth. Um, and I've been working that, uh, Rex Triangle. And, uh, I think you guys might, uh, enjoy what I actually was able to, uh, to find. I have all three of them spawned right now, but we'll head over there and I'll, uh, show you that. On top of that... Um, I tried to work the Thylacolio circle over here, um, no real luck there, but our 140 is pretty good at this point, so I think we're okay there, um, but I did go around the, uh, Scorched Earth area, so over by, I think that's Red Obelisk out there, somewhere out there, I think, it's either there or there, I can't remember, um, we found a few things, I found a, um, Found two Argents that are level 145, um, so we're going to be uh, taming those, and it's a male and a female, which is kind of cool too. Uh, so we have those, so we have a chance of breeding uh, Argents eventually too. Um, and then what else did I find? Um, over on this side, like right here, there is actually a level 145 Thorny Dragon. Now, looking at the saddles, I don't remember which one um, it's in. I ended up making a second smithy. Just so um, it's easier to hold all of our items and everything. Because I could do a... Um, to be honest, I could do the... Um, whatchamacallit? Um, the storage boxes and stuff. But they don't hold as much as a smithy. And to be honest, I had all the stuff anyway. So might as well just do it, right? Um, let me go in here, though. Let's see kind of what we... Uh, so we have a, yeah, that's one of the, uh, Morella Top Saddles. I have a few Morella Top Saddles. Uh, Thorny Dragon. I mean, we have a 93, uh, armor Thorny Dragon saddle that we could just put right on it right now. Um, so yeah, we're gonna, uh, tame that, um, we're not gonna tame that first because it looks like it just came down, but it looks like we have a red drop over there, which, uh, yeah, uh, it's a red drop. So we're gonna go for that first. Um, so the plan is we are going to go over here, get the red drop. Then I'm going to show you all the Rexes that I kind of have lined up over there, which is kind of cool. Um, and then after the Rexes, um, there's another little uh, surprise, too, that um, I was actually excited to see um, as I was flying around here and everything. So let's get to this drop first, and then we'll uh, take it from there. The one thing I have been looking around the uh, map for, which I haven't had much luck, is a Morella Tops. Uh, we have a we have a couple really good blueprints, uh, Morella Top saddles. Um, yeah, so I was kind of hoping to get a Morella Tops over here, just because. I mean, it's not a hundred percent necessary. Ooh, that's a red with a ring around it. Ooh, sweet. Okay, let's see what we get. Um, yeah, I just haven't really had much luck. I think the best I found was like a level one twenty. Which is good, but at the same time, if I'm going to tame one, I'm going to tame a 145 plus at this point. Um, so let's see. Well, 140, 145 plus, obviously. Um, so let's see what we got here. Let's see uh, if it's anything good. Uh, whoops. Uh, homing missile, flamethrower, uh, ascendant whip. Okay. Um, I don't think I'm ever going to use a whip, but that's kind of cool. Uh, we got a medium crop plot, which we don't really need. We got another canteen, so I'm going to take that. That's that's good. Uh, I'm going to drop these guys. We don't need a cluster grenade right now. We don't need that. We don't need that. Um, I already have one of these. We don't... Eh. Yeah, I'll hold on to it. It's fine. We don't need the sander stone. We're going to keep that whip. Uh, 402.8, which is pretty good. Um, I don't know what we're going to do with it yet, but um, we're going to keep this guy, too. Let's, uh, yeah, let's head on over, though. So right down over here should be the first one. Where are you? 
Now I'm kind of trying to figure out if I want to use the Thylacolio for this, or maybe we'll just use the Argent and just go a little higher and just start shooting him. But let's see, uh, let's see where he is first. Okay, he's right there. Uh, so yeah, first one, 140. Uh, pretty, pretty good right from the start, which is nice. Um, this didn't take too long either. What the good part about it is, with the Argent, at least um, coming down with the Argent. Once I got this one to 140, I didn't even bother coming back over here. I went to the next one and literally would um, go from the second one. I would kill it and then kind of head over that way to that, like, mountainous area over there. Kind of hang out there because there's a lot of Argents over there. Come on back and rinse and repeat and just wait till we get a decent level one, which uh, we did end up doing. And then pretty much the same thing with the one in the desert, which is kind of cool, but... Um, let's see what we can do about this guy right now. Um, I'm not going to take the Thyla out. I want to see if we could just do this from here without him. I don't think he'll be able to get up here. If he can, then, uh, yeah, but I think we're okay. Uh, I want to put him on passive. I don't think it could get up here, right? I think we're okay. Yeah, we're all good. All right, come here. Uh, let me put him on neutral, actually. Now that I know the Rex can't get up here, and if I could actually hit him, that would be nice. Uh, he's getting a little close. Nah, we're okay. Okay, cool. Not sure if you can get a headshot with a Rex, but we will... Uh, let's see. Maybe, like, right by the eye? Nope. Alright, you might not be able to. It's fine. What's nice about the location of this Rex is there is nothing in the area. So once uh, once he knocks out, we'll be able to let him just sit for a while. Which is good. Um, and what's pretty cool is over by that uh, rocky area that I mentioned uh, before, it's actually, yeah, over like that way. Um, hopefully it's still there, but I did see an Ovis. Um, which will help uh, with the taming of this guy and then the uh, other Rexes too, along with the Argents. I mean, we get a lot of uh, you get a lot of um, mutton out of it, so we should be pretty good. So I'm hoping this doesn't take too much longer. Uh, put a decent amount in them already, but again, it is a 140, so. The good thing is it doesn't look like he's bloody, so. Uh, maybe a little bit. Let's just make sure. So it looks like yeah, a little bloody. Okay. Just gotta uh, be careful now. Might be a bit concerning that he's getting bloody already, which means that the uh, health on this guy might not be the best. Okay, look, he's taken off. Okay, good. Uh, I was hoping he was gonna get stuck, but um, let's see if I can just do it from here. And if I hit him, that would be nice. Okay, you know what? Urgent, come on. Yeah, this might have been best for the Thylacolio. Okay, it's fine. Come on. Alright, at this point he's running, so I could pretty much... I'm pretty safe here. Just dropping down. The only concern I have is just uh, watching for anything else. I think we should be all good, though. If I can hit him, that would be great. Come on. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh. Okay, I thought we were okay. Ah, okay, we're good. Woo. Come on. Come on. 
coming. Yeah, you know what? Thylacolio made up. There we go. Sweet. Okay. All right. And he's down. All right. Let's see. Uh, let's see what the stats are, just to get an idea. Two hundred five. Okay. Uh, Fifty-seven twenty health. Not bad. Uh, Thirteen forty-four stam. Not bad. Uh, Six twenty weight. Whatever. Uh, Two hundred five melee. Okay. That could. That could be okay. Uh, where's my Arjun? Okay. So let's just make sure around the area that we're okay here. He should be pretty good. Okay. Um, all right. Where is that Ovis again? Oh, yeah. That's right. Over here. Okay. Let's hurry up. Let's see. And then I'm going to check those... Uh, uh, you know what? I don't know why. I just keep checking to see if we have a high-level thorny dragon, but we do. We do. I just... I would prefer to get a thorny dragon in the... Um, I keep wanting to say Halloween colors. In the uh, Thanksgiving colors, but you know what? It's fine. The one that's actually um, 145 is actually nice looking. It's not holiday colors, but it it is what it is. It's fine. Um, now, the Ovis was right over here before... Now, there are Carnos that come in this area, so... Nope. Uh, yep, there he is. Sweet. Still here. Uh, it's the, yep, there he is. Level 10. And then we have a Morella Tops, maybe. Nope. All right. Well, we got a Novus. There we go. Sweet. All right. That's good. Uh-oh. Wait, where's the body? Oh, no. Uh... Oh, it's right there. Uh, there we go. Let's get uh, let's get all this. All right, that should be more than enough. Um, let me drop the. Uh, where is it? I need to drop the pelt though. There's no need for that. Um, all right. In the meantime, uh, let me show you the next one. So the next one should be right over here. Um, around this area. And this one... Alright, let's try this again. And this one... Where'd he go? There's no way anything killed it. Where are you? Where'd you go? Ah, oh, there you are. You're up here. Okay. That's right. Uh, we have a 130. Yeah, pretty cool. So we'll take this one out too. And you know what? While we're waiting for the other one to uh, go down in food a little bit, I might as well show you the last one, which is this one right here. We have a 125. So we are going to be taming all three of them. Um, and we are uh, we're going to see how we do with them. Oh, blue drop. Blue with a ring around it. Okay, cool. Cool. Take that. Now, I'm hoping with this amount of mutton that we have, we can not only um, tame all the Rexes, um, I'm also hoping to tame... Anything good? Anything good? Uh, uh, not really. Nope. 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 Okay, that's fine. Um... Yeah, so with the mutton that we have, I'm hoping that we can not only tame up the three Rexes, but we can also tame up the Argents, tame, just tame up everything. Um, it'll be the quickest, it'll uh, take the least amount of resources, so we should be pretty good. To be honest, what I may do is I may just drop all the stuff on on it now. It's a little risky, but I don't think there's anything in this area that will really uh, do anything to it. So let me do this first. I'm going to be honest. I don't know how much mutton we should be doing. But we're going to go with 10. Oh. Oh. Oh, 
Oh wow, it's only gonna take three. Okay, sweet. Uh, okay. Take some back. All right. Uh, you know what? Maybe I should just. You know what? Yeah, I guess we're gonna wait. That should be another minute. Not even. All right. Uh, let's put away the rifle. I don't wanna do anything by mistake here. Um. You know, it would be a good idea to look at the food, if that's what I'm uh, trying to do here. Um, yeah, I think it drops at 50, if I'm not mistaken, so we should be pretty close. Yeah, if it's only going to take three for a 140, oh yeah, we're fine. Oh yeah, we're more than fine. It's just going to be the timer, really. Oh, an hour. Oh, we're good. Alright, so let's just wait on this guy. This guy shouldn't take too much longer. Um... In the meantime, should I bring out the thigh? Yeah, you know what? Because we're going to be going up against the, the ones in the desert. So you might as well... Let's just get the thyla out here. Um, I'm just going to show you the stats on the thyla. I'm not really sure if I showed you that in the last episode. Um, I haven't touched health. I haven't touched stamina. Uh, we're up to 565 melee. So this thing hits This thing hits like a truck. Uh, we're at 226 roughly uh, damage-wise, which is pretty good. Um, we're not going to be able to take out anything special like the, uh, wait, why am I putting, why, what am I doing? What am I doing? Um, let's take this because I'm definitely going to need that. Yeah, there we go. Rex is all good to go. Uh, going to take that. Going to take a couple cryos. All right, do that. Let's see what the uh, level is. Ah. All right, uh, 8140 health, not bad. 1878 in stamina. Set. <coughs> Excuse me. Whoa. Uh, 710 in weight. Uh, 284.6 in melee. Well, had promise, but you know, we'll compare and contrast with all of them. But uh, yeah, the melee is not looking good on this one, at least. Um, Argent, I'm gonna need you later. So I'm just gonna put you. Is that a red drop? That's a red drop. Okay. Well, I'm going to use you right now, then. Never mind. Yeah, so I think with the two Rexes, we are going to... Um, we're just going to... Um, words. Um, yeah, I'm just going to use the Thyla for the other two. And then I think we're going to... Um, we're obviously going to use the Argent to get on over there, so I can show you where the two... Uh, other Argents are that we're going to try to tame up. Uh, that we're going to use the Thyla also. Um, just so they can... Eh, nothing really good. Uh, we got that. Uh, that? Nope. Oh, we got an assault rifle. Is that an assault rifle? Uh, no, flamethrower. Ah, no, we have a better flamethrower. That's fine. Uh, I don't need that. Uh, yeah, we'll take the water jar for now. Once the water jar... So, I've actually noticed that in the desert for some reason um the water jar will actually lose water i don't think the canteens do uh, but the water jar does um i would think maybe because of the heat um but i don't know i don't know maybe the canteens do lose water and i just haven't noticed it either but um yeah we have a water source over there so it's not too bad uh, where is the thyla? Okay, I'm gonna put you... Eh, you can stay in the normal spot. You'll be fine. Ooh, we have another Rex already? Oh my god, what level? 15, okay. Well, good. Uh, neutral, neutral, neutral. Uh, neutral. Yeah, so he... So, yeah, she's hitting for 226 already. That was actually pretty cool. We tamed that one up, and all I had to... I mean, yeah, that's true. I guess I left the, uh... I guess I left the area far enough. That's that's pretty cool, though. I didn't realize it would be that quick. Um, all right. Let's take that. Oh, uh, no. What is that again? If it's heat wave, we're okay. Yeah, it's kind of weird. Um, even wearing the stuff that we have, uh, desert cloth. Um, yeah, so the boots, desert cloth, uh, top and bottom. We have a ramshackle hat and then the ghillie gloves. Um, yeah, we're good against heat. Like even during heat waves, I'm not even I'm not even getting affected, which is kind of crazy. Um, let's. 
You know what? Okay. I'm gonna play it safe. I'm not exactly sure. It could be a sandstorm. I gotta start remembering what these sounds mean. I'm gonna play it safe. Let's go back to base quickly. Take the meat. I'm pretty sure it's heat wave, but. Also, um, I don't know if I mentioned this. I've been trying to look for these guys. Um, I've never tamed one. Um, but we do have an Ascendant, um, Le Mantria set? Whatever they're called. The Big Moths. Uh, we have a Big Moth saddle. Um, I don't know... Um... I would like to get one. I don't know how to tame it. I don't know if you, like... I'm gonna look that up and everything once we find a high-level one. Uh, I've been looking around the area here. There's nothing really here, though. Um, so it might be one of those things that we'll have to go when we go over to Ragnarok. I'm thinking that'll, that'll be, uh, the place to be. Uh, nope, that's just a regular purple. I'm not gonna bother with that. So I realized that, um, like on, um, Ragnarok, I've mentioned that you become spoiled with the, um, with the level tapes because they're just so common. The 140s, the 145s. I feel like I've gotten that way when it comes to loot drops on Scorched Earth. They are just everywhere to the point where if it's not a ring, I, I don't even go for it anymore. Which is kind of sad because I'm not really sure what I'm uh, giving up, but it is what it is. It's fine. Um, eh, you know what? Maybe we'll... Well, let's see what this ends up being. Let's play it safe. Let's get out of... Uh, oh, I have all these canteens. I totally forgot. Alright, so I'm going to replace this canteen down here with this. Uh, the water jar, you know what, the water jar we can just get rid of. Because I didn't realize I had another f somewhat full canteen. Um, uh, we should be good there. Um, yeah, I need a tent just in case. Yeah, it's a heat wave, okay. So, I'm gonna bring the tent just in case, like, if we end up having anything, uh, happen to us specifically. But, where's the tent? Um, uh, but we're all good, look, right now, like, it's a little bit of heat, but I'm not taking any damage or anything from it, which is kinda cool. Um, oh, I should mention, uh, we leveled at one point, um, I put it into health, so we went from 260 to 270, the goal is to get to 300, um, looking over this, I think we're not at it, but I think we're cl getting closer to doing the, uh, cryo fridge, I want to say that that's 30, at uh, 30, uh, 88, yeah, it's right here, so we're one off, um, yeah, we're getting there though. So, and the next is the industrial cooker, um, which will definitely help. Um, this will help with, like, dyes and stuff like that. I know I haven't done haircuts, dyes, the whole nine. That'll be eventually, um, because I'm not really sure. I want to dye all the stuff, too, like all the clothes and whatever, and the saddles and everything. But that's going to be a little bit later. Um, but, yeah, let's, uh... Hmm. What's the plan next? Should I go after it? Yeah, we got to go back to our, uh... Thyla. Yeah, you know what? Let's uh, let's get over to that. Uh, let's get over to the Thyla. Okay. Oh, now I'm taking taking damage. Okay. Okay. So it really just depends on like what parts and everything um, you're in. What are we at? Like, yeah, it's 138 degrees. Okay. Um, are we taking? Yeah, we're not taking a lot, a crazy amount of damage though, so we should be okay. Um, actually, the area that we're actually um, all right, too many actuallys. Um, the area that we're going to, um, it's actually a little cooler, which is kind of weird. I guess when you get, like, lower to the ground, it's cooler. Um, maybe that makes sense. I don't know. But if I'm wrong, no big deal. We have the tent. We can set up a tent and then just call it a day. Alright, so our Thyla should be right over here, which, now thinking about it, um, there's going to be another Rex spawn, so let's, uh, let's see what ends up, uh, let's see what the, uh, let's see what the, uh, Arc Gods have decided for us. Let's see if one's, uh, maybe one hasn't come in yet. Okay. Alright, that's fine. Um, where's our Thyla? Oh, no, there is a Rex. Okay, what level? 20, okay. Except, I thought I left the thought. 
Oh, did I take the Thylo with me? Oh, I did. Oh, oh. Well, okay, it's fine. You know, we'll just drop the arch in here. It's no big deal. Um, let's throw the Thyla out. Nope. Alright. Thyla. Alright, let's go through this. Take the canteen, take the canteen, 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 cryopod, cryopod, cryopod. Uh, I don't know. Ah, you know what? It's fine. Yeah, I was going to put a little bit of raw meat on the thylo, but I think the thylo will still prefer... Um, the raw mutton over raw meat, so I'm not going to bother with it. Uh, one, two, three. Um, do that, and then also take the tent just in case. We should be all good, though. Um, you, neutral. You hang out. Let's go. All right, let's take out the Rex while we're at it, too. on up here let's uh, go for round two so I'm gonna do these off camera because we're already uh, we're already a decent amount of the episode in we're already like 20 25 minutes in and we have a lot of stuff to take today. so I'm gonna do this off camera um, and I will bring you guys back when we are on our way to uh, getting a few more tames all right uh, bring you guys back in a few All right, just bringing you guys back a little bit early. Just wanted to show you the uh, stats on this guy. Pretty, uh, pretty good. So it actually started out at um, 230 melee damage. So we're up to 337 in melee, uh, 850 in weight. Uh, the health's low, but because the melee is pretty high. So just comes to show you that actually uh, some 130s might actually be okay. So also, too, just to give you an update, the other one that I tamed, the one that I actually... Uh, that you saw a little bit on camera, the uh, red-looking one. Uh, that was a new spawn. That was actually a 130 female um, that I actually um, was able to knock out. But the problem was, um, I actually left the area so I can take, so I can start going on this guy. I was kind of hoping to knock all three out, let them all sit, and then, um, and then. Uh, yeah, so knock them out, knock all of them out, let them sit, and then just mutton, 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 they would all go right away. Um, so it turns out that the other one, I didn't check the area well enough, and it was actually getting attacked by, like, sabers and stuff like that. The taming effectiveness in total was, like, I think it was, like, 22%. And I didn't realize that. I get, I gave it the mutton, not even, lo not even looking, not even thinking. And so it ended up being, from a 130, it was only, like, level... It was horrible. It was level, like... Just horrible. Horrible. Um, so I ended up literally just um, throwing it in the cryopod, throwing it back out, having it become cryosick, and then I just killed it myself. Um, so I'm going to go out after this last uh, Rex, which should be over here. That should be the one that we were supposed to go after. Um, you know, before we do that... I've been over here a while, so maybe, maybe, just maybe, a new spawn came in over here, and then we can see what we had. Alright, there's a new spawn. Let's see what we got. Nah, nothing good. Alright, I'm gonna kill this. I'm gonna kill this one. I will bring you guys back once we get the other one tamed up. Um, so yeah, I mean, it just comes to show you that you don't have to always go for the 140s, the 150s, and stuff like that. You can, uh... I don't want to hit that, uh, turkey. That turkey will kill me. Um... Yeah, we're all good. Okay, good. Um, yeah, so it just comes to show you that you don't have to always tame the 140s to get pretty good levels. I mean, the 130 that we have is I think melee is by far better than the females that we have, um, which is pretty cool. So I'm going to tame this last one up. I will bring you guys back once this one's fully tamed. We'll go over the stats and everything, and then we will uh, go from there. I'll bring you guys back in a few. 
All right, and we are back with our uh, third Rex team. Let's uh, let's see what we're looking at here. Uh, 7040, 1596, uh, 740, and 296. Okay. Um, not bad, not great, but that's fine. Nope. Okay. There we go. All right, so we are down to 172, um, 172 bullets. Um, strength darts, strength darts. Um, so I am actually going to head back to the base because not only do we need Trank Darts, we need a few more Cryopods. Um, let me... No, not yet, because I don't actually have a Cryopod. So let me... Uh, you know what? Let's go back to the Argent first. We'll have the Argent take us back over. Ooh, what's that? Oh, it's a red turkey. Ooh. Okay. Uh, let's see what the, uh, what the tame is over here, too. Uh, stuck in the... Uh, let's see what level this Rex is first. Uh, level 20. Okay, not worth it. Um, let's just get rid of it. So at least we get another spawn in. And then, uh, yeah, let's head back to the Archer. Alright, let's head back on over here. Unless I brought more cryopods with me, I don't remember if we did or not. Uh, let's take a quick look here and see. If not, I should have some more. Yeah, we're good. Okay. All right. Let's put all that on you. Um, yeah, we're definitely gonna have to go up, go up and get some. Uh, okay. I have four. So two Argents. Okay. We should actually have enough. Um. Let me take everything off of you. Put everything on you. Let's take a cryopod. Let's cryopod you up. There. Oh, wow. Another Rex already? Jeez, the spawns are fast. Level 50. Okay. Not bad, but not... I mean, you know... Not what we're looking for. A one in front of that would have been better, but, you know, it is what it is. But there is something up here that's actually pretty cool that I did find along the way. So, um, if you guys remember, we came over initially to train up the Aloe Army. Um, I brought them around and everything like that, and um, it was a bit of a nightmare. They kept getting stuck on stuff. They kept getting... Um, they just weren't, like, a couple of them were hitting, a couple of, most of them weren't, um, but, um, yeah, we also lost some, like, I finally actually ended up finding them, um, I then realized a couple days ago that, um, I didn't actually find all of them, I actually found a total of 19, but I was like, eh, you know what, it is what it is, uh, whatever, um, of course, as I say that... That's over there, which means... Okay, this one. Mm, okay. Well, the... Well, of course, I can't remember where the hell it is now, but uh, the surprise was that I found the last one. Um, of course, now I can't find it again, but I will find it in a second here. I think it was further this way, I'm going to be honest. Gotta remember. The problem is, um, I saw it about an hour ago, and it's stuck. It's not moving anywhere. Um, no, I didn't actually cryopod it or anything yet. Um, I think it's this rock formation over here. 
Maybe not? Oh, maybe it's that one? It's that one. Okay. Yeah, it should be right in there. Yes, there's the morale top. Sweet. Okay. So yeah, I was using this as a marker to try to remember because uh, it's a low one, but it's a it's a holiday looking one. Um, yeah. So this is the problem with aloes. He got stuck in here. In here. I don't know how. I don't. I don't know when I was over on this side far enough where this could get stuck like this, but yeah. But, uh, the good news is we, uh, we now have all of the aloes, which is good. So let's see how many levels this guy got. It'll kind of give us an idea of what, how many levels the other ones got. Um, but at the same time, this hasn't been cryopotted, so obviously the other ones are going to be higher level. Alright, well, you only got one. You only got one level on that time. Okay. Well, do you have anything good on you? Ah, uh, of course you don't. Okay, that's fine. Well, you know, we'll leave them cryopotted, they'll level passively. Now, my concern is actually, um, I've left the aloes inside the, um, I'm not going to go for that, that's a, I know it's a ring, but it's a white drop, we're not doing that. Um, so I've left the aloes inside the smithy, just for space issues. Do they still passively level? Um, even though we're like rendered, we're all off, or uh, I might have to throw one out just to see what the level is. I'm a bit nervous because I mean, let's be honest, they've been in there for like two, three days and I was really hoping to kind of check one and see that, oh, we got 15, 16 levels, that kind of thing, which we can bump them all into health and then bump them into uh, melee. Um, so the plan is I want to go at least uh, 12,500 health on them. Then I think the rest is just going to be melee because, again, they were doing pretty good from what I remember with the Gamma Broodmother fight. Um, I mean, like, we got it down to about a quarter left, and that's when they all started going. If we had, I mean, that's a total of 3,000 extra health on each of them. Um, and then we bump up the, I mean, the melee is going to be bumped up probably, I don't know, 200, 300 melee. So, I mean, I don't know. Seems pretty good. But let's... Row up. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, okay, wait. He was at 247. That was this one, I think. Uh, we're going to take you out and... Yeah, let's take you out just to kind of say. Oh, wait, no. You're the 240. You're the initial. You're the... Okay. You're the one that I just brought over. So I want to get a different one. Uh, Yeah, 250 is probably going to be a little bit closer to... Let's just get an idea of how many levels they've gotten, if they've gotten levels at all. If they haven't, I'm a, I'm a little in trouble here. All right, seven levels. All right. Maybe I do have to keep them on me. Ah, that would really stink. All right, you know what? I'm going to take all of the aloes with me. Um, we're going to do it that way. We're going to take everything cryopotted. It doesn't add any weight anyway, so it's not like, it's not the end of the world. Alright, there we go. Alright, everything's coming with me here. You're all in here. Um, I'm gonna keep you, I'm gonna keep you. Um, this food has 11 minutes, oh boy, okay. Uh, all right, we, okay, this is going to be, this is going to be close. No, we're not going to have enough time. We're going to have to use raw prime meat on the, um, that stinks. I was hoping to use the, um, I was hoping to use mutton on the Argents, but I guess we're not going to be able to. Um, what am I looking for? What am I looking for? Okay. Empty crowd pod. Wait, why am I getting a crowd pod? Um... The berries is for this guy. Let's just give him some berries. I leveled the Jaboa up. The Jaboa, I'm just giving a melee. Um, again, he's he's only here for looks, let's be honest. Um, and he also lets me know about the weather and whatnot. But 
Yeah, we should all be good there. Um, how are we doing on food? 21 food. I think I'm okay there. Let's just get the rest of the darts. Uh, let's just get the rest of the darts. Let's just get the rest of the darts. Where's the darts? Here's the darts. Um, I'm only going to take another 200 with me. Um, that's uh, That should be more than enough. Um, we have 11 minutes left with the... Um, with the whatchamacallit, with the... Um, Eleven minutes left with the mutton, so you know what? We're gonna tame up the uh, thorny dragon right now. So it's right over here. It's pretty quick. Um, yeah, because we have to go all the way, like yeah, like where. So if you see that mountain where red obelisk is, past that. It yeah, it's all the way over there. We're not getting there in time with the raw mutton, unfortunately. So a lot of it's gonna go to waste, which actually. I can cook the mutton. That should be it, right? Nope, that's a 20. Uh, I think it's further down there. You know what? Sorry about that. little uh, indecisive right now. Um, let's get some wood quickly here. Yeah, because if we get about 20 cooked mutton, that should be pretty good. I mean, honestly, um, with the taming effectiveness and everything, the, uh, what is it called? Um... I'm gonna call it taming effectiveness. The stat basically that you can um, change and whatever. I mean, it's at a point where raw mutton. I mean, bleh, where um, prime meat should be okay, but um, just in case. Nah, you know what? It's not a big deal. It's really not that big of a deal. We'll just use the mutton. I mean, we'll just use the uh, what you call it. It's really not okay. It's fine. It's fine. All right, let's go get our uh, dragon, which should be right over here. Right over here. Where'd he go? He was here. Uh, that should be it right there. Yep, so we have a 145 female thorny dragon. Let me just go up. You know what? I'm going to rest right here for a second. All right, let's get this guy Alright, and of course, we have another uh, weather thing coming in. Um, so the last one was a uh, heat wave. It didn't sound like this. It sounds like a little, like, purring, basically. So I think that's Sandstorm, from what I remember. Um, Drop you down. Let me drop down here. Let me get the phyla. Because I'm a bit worried that if I use the... Where's the phyla? We left the phyla down there, didn't we? Uh, no, I definitely... Okay. Yeah, I'm not seeing a file anymore. Oh. Yeah, we did. Okay. That. Let's get a few, uh... Let's get a few tranks here. So, um... Yeah, the reason is when the, uh, Thorny Dragon does that little, like, poor poor attack, um, it's gonna hit the Thylo. It's not gonna... It shouldn't hit me. I hope it doesn't hit me. All good. Alright, this shouldn't take too long. Come 
hoping Thorny Dragons take uh, Raw Mutton, because if they don't, we're, we're in trouble. Because then that means I'm going to have to gather a ton of berries, but I'm pretty sure they are elite. And of course, this is going to be right in the middle of the sandstorm. This is the sandstorm. I'd prefer it to be, uh, to be rain, but it's not going to be rain. I can tell you that right now. I'm pretty sure. Oh. Oh, okay. It's just another... Okay, it's fine. Uh, out? Out. Okay. Well, uh, to, uh, let's do this. We don't really have a crazy amount of time. Um, uh, mutton, 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 mutton. Please, guy, let the mutton still be okay. Mutton's still good. Okay, not much longer on the mutton, but... Uh, I'm gonna take... Hopefully we have enough time. If we don't, it is what it is. All right, so it's got a couple minutes left. Um, hopefully, I don't remember what they take. I'm going to be honest, I don't remember. Uh, let's look over the stats quickly, though. Uh, 1352 in health, 840 stam, uh, 414 in weight, and 210 in melee. Uh, not bad. Um, pretty good, maybe? I, I don't even know. I'm going to be honest. I have no idea. Um, but we do have the saddle fort, so might as well... Might as well get that on it. So where is the Master Craft saddle? It should be right here, right? Yep. Here we go. Once this girl's tamed on up, I'll put the uh, saddle on her. Um, you know what? Yeah, I'll bring you guys back once this, this girl's tamed up. We'll get it cryopotted, and then we will, um, go hunt down the, uh, Argents. Alright, so not sure what happened here. Um, but I went to get some prime meat because the, um, the whatchamacallit, the mutton ran out. Um, came back, and it's gone. It's not tamed up. Uh, it's just gone. Um, I'm not sure because maybe the heat wave, it was unconscious, it died? I don't know, but it wasn't gone that long. Um, yeah. I don't know. All right, well, never mind on the thorny dragon. Um, I guess what we're going to have to do is we're just going to have to... Uh, we're going to have to go find another one. We're not going to really worry about that in this episode. Um, but, yeah. Um, bit weird. Um, we'll put that back in. It's kind of strange. Never really had that happen before, but it is what it is. Okay, uh, let's see here. So, canteens, I want to take all of them. Because we're going to go down to the water. We're going to fill up all of our canteens. Uh, we're going to take the rest of the cryopod group here. I'm uh, going to get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that. Uh, we're going to keep this because we need that eventually for... Uh, ah, that was for coloring. That's fine. All right. Uh, let's see. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Keep all this. And okay. Um, we're all good here. Let's use the... Oops. Let's get a empty cryopod out for the meantime. Let's see what you have on you. Um, the only thing I'm going to take from you is the prime. Uh, everything else I think we can chuck here. Yeah. All right, so let's do this. I've actually had that happen to um, a few times. So I've had that done only on the. Um, I haven't had that happen on the island. I've had that happen on Ragnarok for me. Um, and yeah, it happened here too. So it's a little weird. I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking that I went so far out of. I, I guess maybe out of render range that it. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I don't know. It is what it is. We'll find one eventually. It's not like, it's not the end of the world. Um, I don't know what happened there. It's a little weird. Never had that happen before. All right. Anyways, let's get some water here for the, let's get the canteens all filled up 
and then we are going to head um, on a pretty long trip. Put you on neutral. Fill you up. Fill you up. Let's get the rest of the canteens. Oh, I have them already. Okay, cool. Let's just go into the water. Uh, fill you up. Fill you up. Fill you up. You up. And you up. Okay, sounds good. Let's go. All right, so I am going to take the trip on over there. When I get there, I will show you on the map kind of where we uh, kind of where we are. And then... Um, I'll bring you guys back, okay? And then we're looking to tame up two of the uh, 145 Argents. There's a male and a female over there. Um, hopefully, uh, hopefully they're still there. All right, bring you guys back in a few. All right, so bringing you back a little bit early because yeah, we have a red drop here, red with a ring around it. So let's see, uh, let's see what we got here. We got a couple Capros, so we do have to be careful here. Um, I'm going to hopefully just bring the Argent down a little bit further and then run up, quickly get everything, and then take off. Let's not even look. Let's wait till we get up in the air. Then we can check. Let's go. All right. Let's see what we got. Uh, we got an Adobe wall. Okay. Thank God. Uh, cluster grenade. We got a Ascendant rock golem. So. Um, yeah, no, I wasn't really ever expecting to tame up a, um, rock golem. I'm gonna be honest, I have no idea even how to do it, but pretty good. I mean, 80 armor is not the best, like, that for Ascendant, that's actually pretty, pretty bad. Um, for Ascendant, I mean, it seems pretty bad. I feel like a lot of journeyman saddles are, uh, 80 plus, so whatever, it's not a big deal. Um, we're at top, ooh, 135, no, 135, that's not bad. Okay. Um, I might have to figure out how to tame up a Morella tops too. All right, let's see what else we got out here. Twenty-five. Let's see if we get a good one of the. There's a. Oh, I thought that said one forty-five. Ah, right, okay. All right, let's see. Uh, you fifty. So the Argent should be, if, if I remember correctly, one of them should be, like, right around here. No, maybe not. Um, no, I think it was... Shoot. Uh, oh, level 20. Um, I'm trying to remember which way I went. Uh, ooh, what are you? You went? You're 100. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, 100. Okay. I went this way. Okay, no, it was this mountain range. Okay, oh yeah, I said near Red Obelisk. Uh, Alright. Let's see where this Argent was. It was a... Okay, yeah, I remember this one. That's not it, but I remember this one. There should be like a white one. Ooh, red. One foot. Ooh. Okay. Um. Yeah, we're gonna tame that one up too. Okay. So we have a red 140. Oh god, Carnos and here. No, no, no. Let's kill the Carnos first. Come here, Carnos. You are not getting that arch. No way. No way. Oh no, no, no. We got the turkey involved. Oh crap. Okay. Go, 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 go. And now we have an Argent. I think it's actually the Argent chasing us. Oh no, he's going for the food. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Whew. Yeah, no, those turkeys, those turkeys hit hard. It should be this one right here, actually. Uh, nope, that's not it. Nope, that's not it. Okay, that's the 30. Yeah, it was all white. It was an all white Argent. Well, like white, green, you know, that kind of thing. Um... Alright, so we have a red 140. Oh, no, I know. Um, that might be it. Oh, that's a 40. Ooh, it's a yellow archer. Ooh. Ah, oh, level 5? Come on. Maybe this one. Maybe it was you? I think it might have been you. 135. 
Okay, you're not the one, but it's not bad. Uh, 25, you're not it. Where the hell did this one... No, it definitely came out this way. I'm trying to remember, I was like following it too before I went back to... Before I went back to base. Um, I'm just trying to retrace my steps here. Hopefully it didn't die. I don't think it would have died. Maybe it was a 135. Maybe that was it. Maybe it wasn't a... No, I definitely saw a 145. Where did I see it? All right, I'm getting distracted with the uh, horses. Okay, um, you know what? I'm going to bring you guys back. I'm going to knock all these out um, that I find. I'll go over the stats and everything once... Uh... Oh, wait, wait, sorry. I told you guys I would show you where uh, where we are on the map. So oh, let me take off the uh, Ascending Gilly for a second so we could see a little bit better. So I am right down here. So this is basically the mountain where you're going to get a lot of uh, Argents in this mountain. And also that peak over there actually gives you a lot of Argents too. Um, but I'm going to look around here. I'm going to try to find those Argents that I uh, mentioned before. And then, uh, yeah, I'm going to tame them and then I'll go over the stats with you. All right. Bring you guys back in a few. All right. So the Argents are up. Uh, let me go over the stats quickly. Uh, let's see. One, two. All right. So the two that I was able to get, uh, 202 ended up being uh, 2701, uh, 1060 in stamina. Um, 656 in weight and 314 uh, melee, which is okay. Uh, let's check out this one. Oh, okay. Uh, 3,285 health, which is okay. Uh, 940 in stam, 378.6 melee. That's freaking good. That's really good. Okay, cool. Um, and then 70, 728 in weight's not bad either. So, yeah, we definitely have a breeder with this one. Um, I'm going to look over all the other Argents and everything like that. Um, obviously, uh, there's a heat wave and everything now. So I'm going to um, I'm gonna look around this area because um, just in this little area, I mean, we got pretty lucky with uh, a lot of Argents and everything. So I'm going to take a look around here. Let me show you right on the map where this is. So we are right in that little canyon. Uh, let me take this off for a second. Just to give you an idea, I am right here. Let me quickly put that on again. Um, just to give you uh, a little tidbit too, right down there is a Explorer Note. So if you are desperate for a level or two, uh, Explorer Note is right down there. Um, but yeah, I am going to call on an episode here. Uh, thank you everyone for watching. Hope you enjoy... Oh boy. Okay, let's change that. Uh, okay, let's... Uh, you know what? Let's do this again. Alright, cool. There we go. Got the angle and everything. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna end it here, everyone. Uh, thank you for watching the episode. Hope you uh, hope you enjoyed it. So, what did we do in this episode? We uh, we got a few rexes. So we uh, I think we have some good breeding rexes. I have to check the 150 back at uh, back on the island. Uh, we we were reunited with one of our last Allosauruses. So we had the full uh, 20 Macallo pack. Um, we were denied a 145 thorny dragon. Uh, still a little bitter about that, but it's okay. Um, and what did we end up getting? I thought we were just going to get one Argent. We ended up with three. So I have one at, at my Argent right now, and then the two, I just went over the stats. Um, but yeah, again, like to thank everyone for watching the episode. Hope you liked it. If you did, leave likes, leave comments down below. Um, if you like the content that I'm putting out, please subscribe to the channel. It definitely helps me. Helps you guys out, too. So it lets you know uh, when new videos are coming out. All right. Um, have a good one, everyone. And uh, see you in the next one.